welcome back. We're going into a Starfire Frenzy. Starfire Frenzy featuring Metroids, maybe? Oh no. Well, we got the Metroid music here. And can I break that? Nope. There was probably a special power-up inside that, but I don't think I'm going to worry about it. On the other hand, this is a red level, so... Maybe I might need it. We'll see. Um, get out of the way, Ninji. Poof, you go. Okay. Bullet bills, too. Not that pipe. Okay. It says to go down now. By down... Maybe it's referring to... Just these skulls right here. And that goes pretty high. So I guess I have a choice between whether to go down or to go up. Maybe not. Well, now I gotta go up. Hmm. How high can the skull raft go, then? Hmm. Well, that's probably the end of it. Multicolor. And I don't think I can go into that. I held the up arrow while trying to go up the pipe. I cannot go up. I'm surprised you don't hurt. Bonsai Bill definitely hurts, though. Hit. There we go. And, wow. Mario's hair did not get singed this time, but I somehow fell right in between. Let's not fall in between the platforms this time. Let's let them jump over to this line right here. What, what troubles are we going to face this time? Well, I guess that's the end of the line, so not too many troubles. Um, you talk. Hey, soldier, don't you know the rules? All guard Goombas are supposed to be outside. Wait a second. Mario, what are you doing here? I suggest you turn back now or Mother Brain will destroy you in the next room. Thanks, but I feel I'm powerful enough, especially with these two power-ups here. Ah, uh, good old foe, Mother Brain. Threat detected! Threat detected! Activate defensive maneuver 31279. Prepare for annihilation. The return of the rainbow shell, which I have to use to break this. Okay, now I remember. It wasn't a bullet bill launcher that I used uh, that one other time to defeat Mother Brain. It was a rainbow shell. And the rainbow shell... I don't think it hurts Mario, but Poodaboo definitely does. That's nice. You can actually use this rainbow shell to get rid of the Poodaboos, make this battle considerably easier. All the obstacles are a bit more predictable. Mother Brain, you gonna do anything, or are you just gonna stand there while these onion rings do all the work for you? Or maybe you're controlling the onion rings, so technically you are doing the work. And I'll commend you for that, but I still want your life to end. As do you want mine. I'm picking up this mushroom, though. Give myself an extra hit. While you have plenty of hits, I have only a limit of three. And I have a rainbow shell with me. Although you have obstacles to hurl at me from all directions, I can only hurl it at you from one. You probably take the same number of hits as you did in the last battle with you. That's what I'm gonna guess. Warning, system shutdown. Self-destruct sequence activated. The base will be destroyed in T-minus two minutes. Wow. Is it really gonna self-destruct? I don't see a timer. But something makes me think it could self-destruct here. Maybe there's rising lava. Okay. The return of the Lakitu shoe. Gonna be careful here. I could probably lose it to the Poodaboos. I can be safely on this ceiling right now. Okay. Um, is that as high as I need to go? Is that as far as I need to go? Oh no, the star is closing in on us. We'll all die in here. Uh-oh. Let's be careful. Let's not do that. Um, we've got to break this open. Do we really have only two minutes? I hope not. 
it might expire soon. If there really is two minutes. If there really are two minutes. Okay, another one. And there's probably no time limit. Probably just trying to scare us. Otherwise, it might show up. I don't know if Super Mario Brothers X... Maybe it is capable of having a time limit in some levels, some instances, because if the original Super Mario Brothers games, well, with the exception of two, were timed, then it makes perfect sense, doesn't it? Okay. Um, a rainbow shell. And the rainbow shell is immune to lava. Okay. How'd that fire not hit me? Speaking of fire, I could use this fire flower right here. Yeah, I think two minutes is up, so I really don't have to worry. And again, the rainbow shell does not even hurt me. Hit! One, two, three, four, and five. It was a trap. I don't know if I need to use the rainbow shell this time. I probably do. So I'm gonna take it with me. Don't know how far I was expected to take the Lakitu shoe anyway. Um, and I jumped too high! Well, I have no more Lakitu shoe to toy around with, so I don't have to worry about making mistakes. Except, of course, jumping too high into the upside down lava. Um, what should I do there? Well, I can get the shell back. Can I take it with me? I doubt it. No, I cannot take it with me. Well, we get another Lakitu shoe. Um, or two. So I guess in one player, it's in case we make a mistake. Um, how high can it go? Well, hugging the wall seems to help. Um, okay, let's be careful. Really careful. Um, now we're just going up. Um, and now we're changing direction slightly. Out of the Lakitu shoe, Mario. Good. Three, two, one, and out. Almost free, but I don't think we're quite free yet. Destruction presumably started, even though Mario can, in theory, take all the time that he needs, because... He somehow has the ability to stop time, and I see a star right there! Can I get to it? Yes, I can! Can I get to it safely? Yes, I also can! There we go, and this leads to a mushroom house? Is that all that it is? Um, ooh, nice! <laughs> a nice little reward for this. Take the hammer, take the Karibo shoe, and what's in here? A uh, fire flower, that's nice. I can guess what's in the second one. Nope. It's the weaker form. Oh well. Okay, so let's head back. And I guess next time I'll return to the mountain climb. Well, after the climb. <laughs>